there's any you know case I think he's still the best player in the world doesn't matter if he's not in the Champions League final yes or no so FIFA 20 is back with a bang and the Yoha are the only safest and most reliable place for you to get your FIFA coins and if you use my discount code GOM at the checkout you'll get yourself a discount In the Ballon d'Or. Well, we're gonna find out very soon, but today we're gonna speculate because we got a load of famous footballers today who are gonna tell you exactly who they think is gonna win the Ballon d'Or. If I give it to the best player of the last season, then it was Virgil van Dijk. But yeah, sit back and enjoy, and I want you lot to let me know in the comments right now. Do you think Lionel Messi will win the Ballon d'Or, or do you think Virgil van Dijk deserves it a little bit more? If any of you can manage to get. Who is going to win the Ballon d'Or in the comments below? I'll give you a hundred pounds to spend on Xbox or PlayStation. So, leave your comments below right now. Now into today's squad builder, as you can tell, we have got the shortlist. Some Becker, we've got Sadio Mane, we've got Mohamed Salah. But if you break down the short shortlist, it's basically out of Virgil van Dijk. Short by Camacho, Robertson. Free header, opening goal for Virgil van Dijk. Cristiano Ronaldo. And of course, Lionel Messi. And the round of applause around this stadium. Is... We're going to start with Virgil van Dijk, and this, this is what he thinks. Uh, so the Ballon d'Or is not something I, I'm definitely thinking of. But if it happens by any, I don't know, chance, then obviously I will take it. But I don't think there is uh, there is any you know case. I think he's still the best player in the world. Doesn't matter if he's not in the Champions League final, yes or no. Basically come out and said, even though he's in the running for Messi and he's basically one of the favourites to win it himself, he still thinks that Lionel Messi is going to easily win. Jose Mourinho's opinion, well, I'm going to let you watch this. An interesting interview. But didn't win the Premier League in spite of he was the, um, the best player, considered the best player. But if Holland managed to go to, to Portugal and win a small trophy, but a trophy, that can play. Messi in Argentina with the American Cup. Um, Salah and Mane in the African Cup. I think Salah better last season than this season, but uh, European champion. Um, Mane, fantastic all season, European champion. And uh, I think Senegal is is qualified for the, for the final phase. People really do believe, including Van Dijk himself, that Messi is going to win this thing. Or do they? Close to the Ballon d'Or awards. Traditionally, it's either Messi or Ronaldo. But Virgil Van Dijk must be in with a shout this year, an individual award, must he? Look, I think that's that's a. It's a. If you talk about if you give the Ballon d'Or to the best player of this generation, and you can give it always to Lionel Messi. That's how it is. But if we, go, if we give it to the best player of the last season, then it was Virgil van Dijk. So, I don't know how exactly how it will work, but um, that's how I see it. If it's for the best player, the best player at all, and of all, then it's Lionel. Best player of last season is Virgil. We will see. Got to respect Klopp's decision to go for his player. He'd be crazy to not agree that a player that's in for the running for his own team shouldn't deserve to win it. In fact, he'd deserve a slap if he tried saying that Van Dijk didn't deserve that. You have to be biased when you're the manager of the team, of the player who could win the Ballon d'Or. You have to be. Let's have a little look what Frankie De Jong thinks. He obviously plays with Messi. I think I said it a lot of times, but I think Messi is the best player in the world. Uh, so I think Messi has to win it, I think. Van Dijk also had an amazing season and he's an amazing player. And the best thing I like about De Jong is even though he knows and thinks that Messi is going to win this year's Ballon d'Or in his head, he still gives Van Dijk an honourable mention. you got to respect that. The prémio says that he is the best player in the world. The best player in the world, in my opinion, is Messi. Today, in the past, two years ago and three years ago. From the moment that Messi doesn't win the best player in the world, with everything he does, he loses a little credibility. Não importa se o outro jogador foi campeão da Champions, se o outro jogador foi, chegou na final. Na minha opinião, o Messi é o melhor do mundo. Faz, faz muitos anos que o Neymar é, vai estar ali, que o Salah merece estar entre os três, que o Cristiano também merece estar entre os três, também. Mas que ele demonstra cada jogo que ele joga que ele é o melhor jogador do mundo. Não tem nenhum. 
He even gives Neymar a mention, and I don't even think Neymar's on the shortlist this year, which is crazy. But yeah, he even gives Neymar a throw, and he even mentions Ronaldo, Mohamed Salah. He's just being honest, and I like that. But yeah, Messi, he thinks, in his opinion, the best player in the world has to win it. I, I, I've been thinking Messi, to be honest. I mean, very rarely you see a, a, a centre-back get that. He says the betting seems to be moving towards Virgil van Dijk, so it wouldn't surprise me one bit. So Jamie Carragher and Jamie Redknapp both have a different opinion, and I'm surprised the Carragher actually came out and went against his own player. But, but we all know Jamie Carragher is one of the most unbiased football pundits when it comes to who he thinks is going to win or who he thinks is going to do better. So you've got you've got to appreciate that. But he actually thinks Messi and Redknapp think Van Dijk. <laughs> Yeah, Mbappe, you know, the wonder kid, he didn't even throw Ronaldo into it. He was just like, Messi's gonna win this year. <laughs> Ronaldo's his fan, he's Ronaldo's biggest fanboy, and he was like, nah, it's all Messi this year. It's all Messi and Van Dijk, but Messi gotta win it this year. <laughs> what a G. But to be fair, Mbappe, he's gonna be chasing for that next year as well, trust me. Some of the best players in the world. It does bear down to Ronaldo, it does bear down to Messi, it does bear down to Van Dijk. Who is gonna take the Ballon d'Or this year? It's gonna be interesting, I can't wait. If any of you can manage to get who is gonna win the Ballon d'Or in the comments below, I'll give you a hundred pound to spend on Xbox or PlayStation. So, leave your comments below right now. Go, go, go now, go.